Karen wants to look at her inbox to see how everything is going. Looks like the team has a long email thread going. To get everyone on the same page, Karen calls a meeting. In Outlook 2010, with a single click, Karen can reply to the email and easily schedule a meeting of the team. The meeting invitation includes the prior conversation for later reference, and she can add a few notes to clarify the meeting agenda. Karen also gets handy mail tips here, letting her know things such as if someone is out of the office. This out-of-office message refers her to someone else who is filling in while this person is out, so she can get the meeting invite right the first time. Using the scheduling assistant, Karen can easily see what times will work for the members of her team. She can see what days are good or bad for scheduling the meeting based on everyone's schedule. She is also provided with recommendations on the best times and days. Since Link is integrated right here, with a single click, Karen can add an online meeting, so the remote team members can easily join. External users can also be invited, and they have the choice of a web app or rich client to join any meeting. When the meeting is ready to begin, Karen can just as easily join the meeting from Outlook. As easy as that, Karen is on the call. No more punching in phone numbers and passcodes to join a call. Her online status in Link has updated automatically to in a conference call, so others know it may not be the best time to try and call her with a question. The remote participants will have a similar experience as they join. Karen can add video to the call. She can share a screen, a program, a PowerPoint presentation, or even create a virtual whiteboard. Tomas is sharing the PowerPoint presentation on the new line, so he can teach the rest of the team how to pitch it. While they continue with the meeting, Karen is going to mute herself and lower the volume. Link intelligently switches video depending on who's speaking. If someone is making too much noise on the call, Karen can easily mute them. See how rich animations can be viewed in PowerPoint. But here's the best part. Karen has seen most of this presentation before and doesn't want to sit through it all again. So while Tomas is bringing everybody else up to speed, Karen can jump ahead to the parts that interest her. If she has a question about a slide and wants to bring everyone to where she is, she can take over as presenter. She can also view other slides privately while everyone else follows along with Tomas. Thanks to Link, Karen's team has had a successful meeting. Before leaving the call, she reminds everyone to edit their parts of the proposal document, which she'll be delivering to the customer. Note that if Karen leaves the call early and needs to rejoin to add some final comments, it's as easy as clicking the Rejoin button.